this is a cart poem. It's one sentence. After I have parked below the spray paint caked into the granite grooves of the Frederick Douglass Middle School sign where men-sized children loiter like shadows draped in outsized denim, jerseys, braids, and boots that mean I am no longer young. After I have made my way to the New Orleans Paris jail down the block where the black prison guard wears the same weariness my prison guard father wears buzzes me in. I follow his pistol and shield along each corridor, trying not to look at the black men boxed and bunked around me until I reach the tiny classroom where two dozen black boys are dressed in jumpsuits, orange as the carp I saw in a pond once in Japan. So many fat, snaggletooth fish ganged in and lurching for food that a lightweight tourist could have crossed the water on their backs, so long as he had tiny rice balls or bread to drop into the mouths below his footstep, which I'm thinking is how Jesus must have walked on the lake that day, the crackers and crumbs falling from the folds of his robe, and how maybe it was the one fish so hungry it leapt up his sleeve that he later miraculously changed into a narrow loaf of bread, something that could stick to a believer's ribs. And don't get me wrong, I'm a believer too, in the power of food at least, having seen a footbridge of carp packed gill to gill, packed tighter than a room of boy prisoners waiting to talk poetry with a young black poet, packed so close they'd have eaten each other if there'd been nothing else to eat. Mm.